Here, right, right up a little closer. I, I, I do this for a living, so I won't crash, promise. Okay, we are starting up. 26th annual bridge pedal. Look at all these wonderful people. Whee! Let's see if we can uh, hear what's on folks' minds. What? Are we on TV? So are we having fun yet? Yes. Oh, man. Here, right, right up a little closer. I, I, I do this for a living, so I won't crash, promise. It's a beautiful fun? day in Portland. Come on out, everyone. Come join the ride. You, you're like a pro at this, Of a huh? lifetime. You, you're, you've done this before? I've done this before. Yeah. I'd like to say, I'd like to welcome all event participants to this uh, beautiful <laughs> Portland bike pedal, bridge you're, pedal. You're like the bridge pedal queen. You're I acting am. like you're the, the <laughs> yeah. what is it, Grand Marshal or something, I am the right? Grand Marshal. <laughs> okay, where are we headed now, do you know? I think we are going to go uh, across the next bridge. Not quite sure <laughs> what no, See, that was a test. Do you, you have any idea what bridge we're headed towards? No, no, I don't. You, I thought you've done this before. I have done this before, but I You just, just follow the people in front of you? Yeah. I'm, what? The, I'm like a sheep. <laughs> just, just kidding. Well, wait, wait, what? <laughs> hey, good morning. How are you today? Good morning. I'm doing well. How are you? Good, thanks. First bridge pedal? Second bridge pedal? First time. Really? First time, yeah. Okay, well, so far, so good, huh? So far, so good. I always wanted to do it, but this is my first time. Cool, what, uh, what brought you out this time? I always forget about it until I see the bridges close. <laughs> and I'm like, damn it. But I make sure that I sign yeah. early enough. Yeah. You I don't, only ride when the freeways are closed? <laughs> no, I don't ride a lot. I mean, I done the, the STP seven times. Oh, okay, so this is nothing so, for you. Yeah, I mean, which is there like not too long ago. So So you 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 did some training for bridge pedal, so you ought to you're really gonna crush this oh, thing, yeah, huh? Yeah, this is easy. <laughs> hey, thanks for talking. Yeah, of course, man. I, I love your content though, by the way. Oh good, I'm glad. Thanks for saying that. Yeah, of course, dude. Is that Tina? It is. Jumping. Good morning, Tina. How are you? Good, how are you? Good, thanks. Having fun so far? I am, it's amazing. I'm riding on the freeway. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> this is my friend Kirsty and my daughter Hi, Kirstie. Lisa's up there. Oh good. So this first time bridge pedal. Yeah, awesome. yeah, this is the first time. And your friend nudged you into it? She did. She sent it a couple times and talked me into it, so here I am. So far so good? Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. great. Yeah, I'm actually on my non-electric bike, so I'm I'm wow. I'm trying to like do this whole thing under my own power. Have fun. Awesome, thank you so much. Bye. Wait, wait, let's talk politics. Wait, no, everybody's riding away. But 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 let's let, wait. <laughs> okay, so uh, I just uh, asked some folks, if we started talking about City Hall and, and politics, and then I yeah. pressed record and they all suddenly rode away. So oh. anyway, funny how the next person I see is Beaverton City Councilor-elect Kevin Teeter. Good, Good to, to see you. you. Yeah, Good to you, see too. you too. Hey, did you do the Beaverton ride last night? Yep. We rode about 10 miles with a good group of people, um, ended at the Beaverton Night Market. We just want to show people how great biking is and can be in Beaverton. Um, but we want to come out for the bridge pedal too. Yeah, wait, could there be a bridge pedal kind of thing in Beaverton? Was yeah, that would be awesome. I love the dream. Speaking of the dream, downtown loop, big news. Yeah, yeah so Beaverton did just get a $2 million grant for helping plan some design improvements for the Watson and Hall couplet in downtown Beaverton. And it's those a, are gonna be car free, right? Uh, right? Well, that's what I, <laughs> I would love to see something like that, but it's gonna take some pushing from from people like us who really care about this sort of stuff to make it safe for people walking and biking and taking transit. So if you want to see it, share with me. I'll help you learn how to share your voice too because um, we need we need some good progressive voices out there. Well, here's to uh, Beaverton Bridge Pedal 2024. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Good to see you all. <laughs> you too. See you, Kevin. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm risking life and limb going on the dirt to talk to this wonderful person. You can't wear an outfit like that and not expect to have someone with a video camera talk to you. <laughs> How's it going? It's going great. How are you? Um, I'm vaguely nervous because I'm not a good bike rider, but this is uh, oh, just, amazing. Yeah, just act like I'm not here. So stay to the right a little bit so folks can get, get, get by you. Yeah, I do, this, I do this for a living, so you don't have to worry about me. I'll adjust to you. So go ahead and ride like normal. Okay. Ha having fun so far? It looks like yes. you're having fun. Yes, it's excellent. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> kind of our first time out on the bike, so... Yeah, it's like, a big one. are you always this fashionable or just something you brought Absolutely. out for bridge pedal? Absolutely, always. How do you describe what you're wearing? Tiger, jumpsuit, I don't know. I'm very, I'm a cat lady. You're a cat lady? There's my Where's cat your man. cat? There's my cat man. Cat man? Yeah. Are you going to get one of those little buckets you can put your cat in on your bike? I don't think they'd appreciate it. Oh, on the ride? Is it a no <laughs> cat ride? <laughs> oh, hey. Come on. Actually, I actually just wanted to talk to your dog, so could you just yeah. move up a little this bit? This is Chewy Nugget. Oh, hi, Chewy. You having fun, bud? You want to play with? He thinks this is a dog toy. My <laughs> mic. It's not. Having fun so far? 
Yeah. Uh, do you know where we're going? We're going on some bridges. Which one? Uh, I think we're gonna do the so No, dance. you passed the test. I think a lot of people are just on here just following the just doing person it. in front of them. <laughs> yeah. You a bridge pedal veteran or? Yeah. Yeah? yeah. How, how many Although, you done? Well, not since 2019. So, oh, okay. A little yeah. bit of a break. A little bit of a break. All right, here we are. We're back. We're things, here. Things you are back to normal. Right Ish. Yeah. Never be normal, but yeah. <laughs> cool. Okay, what else you want people to know about, uh, I don't know, biking in Portland? Biking in Portland is phenomenal. We have the Springwater Corridor, and we have some amazing bridges that shut down once a year so that we get to explore them. I'm going to go over the awesome. Interstate Bridge next and Ooh. get the tallest view in the city. It's pretty sweet. It's going to be great. Okay, have fun. Take Thanks it for easy. Talking. See ya. Wait, bye, Chewy. Chewy. Bye, Chewy. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to keep up with this little one, huh? I have my work cut out for me, that's for sure. <laughs> this is his first time. Wow. He, he's only had that bike for a couple months. Is it hard keeping up? Yes. Or more like nerve wracking probably <laughs> than hard. <laughs> or both? <laughs> Maybe both, yeah. He's only had the bike a couple months? <laughs> yeah. If folks can't, uh, probably can't see him of course, but he's this little dude. How old is he? He will be seven in November. This so little, six and a half, basically. This little uh, almost seven year old yeah. dicing around the crowd here, <laughs> raging. Oh great, what brought you out this time? Him. <laughs> really, he really wants to come. Yeah. I love it. You all uh, bike a lot around your neighborhood too, or? A little bit, you know, we're in Southwest, so the hills make it a little challenging, but yes. Well, have fun. Thank you. Bye. Ted, how are you? I'm having a great day. Fantastic day for a bike ride. What makes it so great? Well, there's me and 10,000 other people out here cruising the freeways of Portland. Isn't that something? It doesn't get old. I haven't done this for years and it's like, you know, taking over freeways or something about it. Yeah, yeah, let, let me tell you a story. I moved here 14 years ago and the dream for Portland was that in 14 years, everything would look like this. Half of the freeway lanes would be closed or at least one or two of them here and there. And at rush hour, there would just be bikes cruising four abreast to get downtown and all the new infrastructure would be built for bikes cruising four abreast to get downtown because that's how many we'd have. You know, sadly, that hasn't happened. If we want to make it happen, it's going to be some sort of a different story how we get there. But bridge pedal is the inspiration. She be, being here, is, is, it's a lot different than Sunday Parkways because this is highway riding with 10,000 people. Ah, uh, yes. I think um, this little seed is, gets planted in a lot of people that do this. People go home and think, you know what? Car free streets. It's pretty cool. And then maybe if they hear about it from an advocacy group, they might sound a little different. Yeah, yeah. I mean, this is car-free highways. This isn't car-free streets. True. You, you see, yeah. like, the problem with getting around in Portland with all this new infrastructure is that it's really slow if you want to actually get it, get across town because mm. all these little protected bike lanes, it's just a lot slower so, if there's a group because you're stuffed in the seven foot wide bike lane. It used to be like a 13 foot wide bike lane. Yeah. So it'd be easy for lots of groups to okay. sort of overtake each other comfortably. Yeah. The fast riders could get out to 82nd and whatever in time for daycare pickup at 525 or whatever. Right, right. But if you put in all sorts of uh, barriers like that into the system, instead of building highways for bikes, uh, you're not really building a future for an American city because yeah. American cities are all sprawled out. You know, that works in Amsterdam and Copenhagen, but we have to have faster systems here. So, uh, uh, Mayor, Mayor Wheeler, if you could say, say something to him or ask him something, what would it be? Build for capacity. Lots of bikes traveling at different speeds all comfortably and have more events like this where you close the highways to streets and you get people out riding on them to experience how fast you can actually get somewhere at least in theory if it wasn't so crowded like today is there a router bridge you think would be good to like what would you if you had to choose one to start oh, with? oh super interesting um certainly broadway going uphill from burnside to psu mm. you can make a three-lane bike lane there so that uh, the 19 year old kids late for class could just jam up it as fast as they wanted to go and everybody else could just uh, go at their pace. Yeah, I hear you. So your your thing is like, we got to build so that not just for capacity, but so that bikes can actually have competitive trip times and go super fast on highways. Anything else you want to share with folks? Uh, next year, ride bridge pedal. Do it. <laughs> Thanks, see ya. You bet. Hi, you guys want to be in my video? Yeah. Yes. What do you like about bridge pedal? Oh, it's awesome. I mean, we rode our bikes on the freeway, so yeah. <laughs> How you doing? You gonna make it up this thing? All right. Huh? It looks, you're gonna make it up this thing oh, just yes, fine, huh? Will. Yeah, easy, Definitely. easy. Easy for you, huh? You, you... I got this media guy talking to me. Oh, you got, I'm sorry. I didn't mean oh, to interrupt, no. interrupt your phone call. Right, <laughs> what made you do it this time? What inspired you? The weather. Here, let's not crash into anything. No, exactly. Okay, wait, come on. Nice. What do you, uh, what have you liked about it so far? I think the camaraderie, I love seeing the confident kid cyclists, mm. you know, those just learning and those that have a lot of experience, so it's 
love yeah. to see the next generation of riders. Yeah. Do you, do you, do you bike a lot when you're not on a bridge pedal? I would say I'm a fair weather cyclist. So in the summer, yes. Winter, not so much. What's your rating of the weather today? Perfect. Not too hot. There's a nice breeze to keep us cool. Well done. <laughs> there sure is something uh, very magical about riding a bike on a freeway with no, uh, no cars. Except all the suckers next to me in the uh, other side of the freeway. It's a beautiful thing. Oh, not that. This is the beautiful thing. Oh yeah. Is this a rogue rogue faction from Bridge Pedals, like a breakaway group or something? What happened? Do you like you guys lost? You're supposed to go left at Interstate. Yeah, we we're, we're rebels, you know. We, we do what we want. How's this compared to a Petapalooza ride? Did you go on bridge pedal? I did. A little I did. bit? Did you like we, it? We went right in early at 6 a.m. And I think it's breathtaking just to get the, the view of the Fremont Bridge, 405. And I love just like riding on the freeways, seeing that bikes can take over. Yeah. Kind of waving at all the cars in the opposite direction and getting, <laughs> getting awkward glances. <laughs> And I know you do a lot of pedal palooza rides, so like, what's is there a different vibe on this one? You think? Yeah, I think there's more of a push for like, you know, moving away from fossil fuels. We're using infrastructure that's designed for cars, but we're using it for bikes. The Fremont Bridge and the interstate, like the 405 freeway specifically, um, it's just really nice. I think other folks like say, someone you know drove over to the ride from the west side, and like, you think they go home thinking, you know what? We don't really need all these all this space for driving we could bike more on these things i hope that is a takeaway <laughs> yeah. they come out with i hope this is type of a ride that like changes people's minds i think it also shows like how bikeable generally portland is wish you were more frequent but it gets people out on bikes who are not usually on bikes i feel like we can market pedal palooza to this crowd be like hey you like riding with all these people and taking over the city we do this three months out of summer yeah <laughs> every day yeah, unfortunately, there's only like two weeks left to pedal Palooza, but one last final push. Yeah, speaking of which, I'll let you get your catch your breath up this hill. <laughs> Thanks for chatting, William. All right, thank you, Jonathan. Bye. Bye. All right, that is it from Bridge Pedal 2022. We really hope you enjoyed uh, riding along with us. And until next time, I'll see you in the streets.